Good day, welcome to Martinez Design. In this traffic tutorial, we are going to talk about how to adjust this certain elevation and bring some of what some certain elements that are not here before. So please kindly subscribe to this channel. At the same time, always like and comment. Say what you see about the about the video so that we'll be able to amend it further. So thank you. So what you do first is say there's some irregularity among the videos. I mean among the windows. This part is going up and some other are going up. So how do you do that? Go to your 3D select click on this. You see from the head height you have 25. When you look at this this one, you have uh, 2001 and 2000, I mean 21. 2100 millimeter height. Why this one is 2500 millimeter height? So, what we do is that you select this particular one and say, right click, I say select all instance in the in, in view. You see that the header is face, but what you need to do is to click on it. So, type 21. So, everything is going to be uniform. Say so apply. You see, the the upper one they are not changing the position but the lower like, one change position and everything fix so you do the same thing and all, all around whenever you have such cases so that is so that now you go to front elevation click on this and you do what you want to create the back opening by creating the half around this space so what you do is to go to your level two and that level two so at this place is what we want to create and we don't want to touch the to read the floor to read the beer floor. So click on the on your floor and say create similar. I create a similar or this uh offset base, click the the height you want it to start from so from two heights. You just want it to be a little bit of a window, then here the minimum will be 800 because of the, the level with the, the number. So you click on this and say, click on this and say, finished. So you can go to the one as well to create similar, so you create similar. At this point, you do the same thing 22, 2200, and you do this one, say 800. So you do the same thing here as well. Good, escape, and click the same thing. Good. So when you go to elevation now, you are going, likely going to see them there. Can you see? So if you go on it on 3D, you see that it will reflect on that 3D personally. So here is what you have done. So you can decide to say adjust it by clicking on what. Good. And this is seems here. Everything is going to be closed. So that's how you are adjusting your elevation one after the other. So the next thing to do is to create a the uh, belly arc around this space. So how do you do that? I want to work on this on 3D by using sweep. So you go to architecture and click model in, uh, components. You see model in place. Just choose case work. You say okay. Click on case work to look at your name into your phone cell whatsoever or arc arc build. So you just name it whatever you think that is accurate to your so click on create and say create sweep on the create sweep just pick on this particular 3D pick on it and start doing what is necessary on the 3D part. Mm -hmm. So you trim this on the same time on that 3D so you have it in this way 
to finish and make sure that all your lines all this all the pink line that you are doing make sure they are just in a close loop all of them join together so click on this and say edit profile you can edit the profile on the 3d here but you for the more accuracy just like to go to level one and go and do the clear work so here and you just do, need to adjust it a bit so click here like this so on this Decide to say okay, finish it and finish everything. So when you go back to 3D, you can see what you have created. So here you can copy this one, go to South Elevation and say copy, put it to the top. So as you get that, and this, and let's say edit again. So we want to do the peak points. So pick the hedges, move to west, and adjust this one to the base where it's supposed to be. So how these are techniques of doing what? Of working with your rabbit. So click on finish and you see that you have that as well. So that's how you work on the elevation. So for now you change the material by lighting and it and okay. And this material, the material pop up, so you adjust it by saying, okay, duplicate this one. You can rename it to you so that you name it to your suitable. So, so that by the time you are, maybe you are using the rendering, you know the particular material you are using in that light. So click here and say adjust it. I say ceramic. Okay, I think to so edit it, duplicate it first. <laughs> this is the one, this is the 10 material. You name it if you want to. So do that and say, okay, I want to use ceramic for the tight. And just let me do this particular one. Good. I'm adjusting the color from here to something like blue. And I'm taking it to the higher point. Uh, so this has adjusted itself. I'm bringing it here. So when you click on finish, the bring it to the, you will find something unique within the space of what you are doing. So it's so the thing you do while you design consistent. So you can take the material of this and adjust yourself where you want to adjust. So, in the next program, we are going to do more on the site and address it based on what we want to do. So follow us, like our our project at the same time, subscribe to our channel for every day.